the hot seat on gate room two. Ready to look down on this sequence here. So we're looking at this to this to this, and then we cross them. Okay. So just continuing on, I mean, Paddy's just going to come in with punches. I'm coming forward, and you get into that um, thumb position. I wanted to snap him down as in the first drill, but maybe I can't. Maybe Paddy's going to start punching again with that hand. So I'm controlling, I turn sideways as in the kata, and there's that elbow strike. You look at the sequence last time from there. But maybe if I don't put him down with this, the kata's telling us of two options. If he's got her, okay, I'm going to grab the back of the head here, and I'm going to do that Gidan Barai, that low block, pull him this way. Okay. From there, I have this root punch to the face as he comes down. The next move in the cat is this, this cross step here, which is actually your stump. So, so, so when he went for that elbow strike, and maybe he, stopped, he brings that hand up and he strip it, and he hit it again, if he doesn't go down from here, he can actually grab it there. Pull, as your pull block, in this position. Here's a good punch. And as he falls, the cross step is into the stump. Um, Variation you can do if he's got a short bar, over, from here, okay, if they haven't got a connection, I'm just going to grab the back of the head. My right hand binds the chin. Again, we have to roll this very carefully because it's a neck crank. I'm just rotating him to this position here to take him down, and then he have to stop, which is this move. Okay, time on that. So again, from here, I'm going for these um, elbows, strip it down. Maybe he doesn't go down, just grab the back of the head, go to the chin, take it over, and I have a stomp. That's sound. 